Do you know the 10 most important incidents in Hitler's life? Born in 1889, Adolf Hitler spent his early years in Austria-Hungary. In the quaint town of Braunau am Inn, a child was born who would grow to shape world history in unimaginable ways. Young Adolf's life was unremarkable, filled with the typical trials and tribulations of childhood. His humble beginnings were a stark contrast to the infamy he would later gain. From these ordinary beginnings, no one could have predicted the infamous path Hitler would take. In 1914, Hitler found himself on the battlefields of World War I. Serving in the German army, he encountered the brutal realities of war firsthand. Wounded in action, Hitler's courage under fire earned him decorations for bravery, including the Iron Cross First Class. This intense period of service impacted him deeply, shaping his views on nationalism and warfare. The experience also hardened his resolve, fueling his ambition to transform Germany. This war experience was a transformative period for Hitler. In 1920, Hitler joined a political party that would soon become infamous worldwide. The German Workers' Party, a small and relatively unknown group, caught Hitler's attention with its strong nationalist and anti-Semitic doctrine. Seeing an opportunity, Hitler quickly rose through the ranks, transforming it into the National Socialist German Workers' Party, or more commonly known, the Nazi Party. Hitler's charisma, coupled with his skill in public speaking, attracted a growing number of followers. This marked the beginning of a dark chapter in world history. The year 1923 saw Hitler's first attempt at seizing power. In a bold move known as the Beer Hall Putsch, he aimed to overthrow the Bavarian government. This audacious coup, however, was a failure. Hitler was swiftly arrested and sentenced to prison. But behind bars, Hitler found the time and space to pen his manifesto, Mein Kampf, outlining his political ideology and future plans for Germany. This period of incarceration was far from wasted. His time in prison fueled Hitler's ambition for power. 1933 was a pivotal year in Hitler's life and in German history. On January 30th, the tables turned dramatically when Hitler was appointed Chancellor of Germany by President Paul von Hindenburg. This marked the dawn of a new era, an era of dictatorship that would change the course of the world. Hitler, once a soldier, a party member, a prisoner, had now climbed the political ladder to seize the highest office in Germany. Hitler now held the reins of power in Germany. With the passage of the Enabling Act, Hitler's grip on Germany tightened. This act, passed in March of 1933, was a pivotal moment in Hitler's rise to power. It bestowed upon Hitler the ability to enact laws without the need for parliamentary approval, effectively bypassing democratic checks and balances. This unprecedented power allowed Hitler to shape Germany to his own ideals, without any opposition from the Reichstag. The Enabling Act was the key that unlocked Hitler's dictatorship. Hitler now had unchecked control over Germany. In 1934, Hitler purged potential political rivals in a brutal event known as the Night of the Long Knives. This was a calculated move, a stroke of political genius, albeit a dark one. Hitler ordered the execution of leading figures within the SA, the paramilitary organization instrumental in his rise to power. He also targeted conservative critics and old enemies, effectively silencing any opposition. This ruthless act further cemented his dictatorship. Hitler had now eliminated any serious threats to his rule. In 1938, Hitler expanded the borders of Nazi Germany. This year marked the infamous Anschluss, the annexation of Austria. Austria, the land of Hitler's birth, was incorporated into Nazi Germany without much resistance. This annexation was a clear violation of the Treaty of Versailles, which had ended World War I but the international community largely turned a blind eye. This laid the groundwork for Hitler's further territorial ambitions, setting the stage for the horrors of World War II. Hitler's territorial ambitions were becoming clear to the world. Hitler's invasion of Poland in 1939 marked the beginning of World War II. This audacious move was a clear breach of the Treaty of Versailles, which had ended the First World War. Hitler's forces swept across the Polish border, initiating a ruthless campaign of swift and brutal warfare. This blatant act of aggression was a step too far for Britain and France. 
they responded by declaring war on Germany, marking a pivotal moment in history. The world was now at war. In 1945, Hitler's reign of terror came to an end. As the tide of war turned against him, Hitler found himself cornered in a bunker in Berlin. With Soviet forces closing in and defeat imminent, he chose to end his own life. On April 30th, the man who had once held the world in a grip of fear committed suicide. His death marked a pivotal moment in history. With Hitler's death, World War II in Europe reached its conclusion. A dark chapter had ended and a new era of peace began to dawn. From his birth in 1889 to his death in 1945, Adolf Hitler left a dark mark on world history. From a soldier in World War I to the founder of the Nazi party, his rise to power was marked by significant events, including the Beer Hall Putsch, the Enabling Act, and the start of World War II with the invasion of Poland. His life concluded with his suicide in 1945. Thank you for joining us on this journey through Hitler's life. Don't forget to subscribe for more historical insights.